Hey everybody, it's Claude the Clocks999, welcome to Kanji Super Mario Brothers. I mean, uh, All Night Nippon, Super Mario Brothers for the Famicom Disk System, the 10th game in the Super Mario series. Now, this is kind of an obscure Mario game because, you know, because, well, obviously it was a Japan-only game, but not, but also the fact that it was not necessarily a major release, it was more of just like a joke game. Um... This is a is a game in the Mario series uh, made by Nintendo, but it was published by Fuji Television. Now, All Night Nippon Super Mario Brothers was, is a version of the game based on a Japanese radio program called All Night Nippon. This or Nippon, I'm pretty much sure it's pronounced Nippon. And and basically, it would it was a game. It was basically like a collaboration thing. Um, by Nintendo and Fuji Television, and, and it was given out as a raffle prize on the show itself. Uh, let's see. The game is basically just basically just a replica of um, of the original Super Mario Brothers with a few um, graphical with a few graphical changes, but also but also um, you know, but also some of the levels were changed a little bit, and a few of them were edited a little bit. And then there's also the fact that just like in Lost Levels, you can play as Luigi, who is who jumps higher than Mario, runs faster than Mario, but stops slower than Mario. Um, but 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 at the cost of the two-player mode being completely removed. Um, yes. So let's see the the differences the, the differences that were made in levels are. Um, In a moment, I'm kind of reading this off my. Uh, I'm kind of reading this off my uh, 3DS browser. Yeah, spoilers. That's what the. That's one of the future Nintendo systems. Um, uh, let's see here. World. This is basically the original Super Mario Brothers with this change with some changes. World 5-3 was replaced with World 4-3 from Lost Levels. 5-4 was replaced with Lo with 5-4 was replaced with 2-4 from Lost Levels. 6-4 was replaced with 4-4 four four from Lost Levels, and, and, and 7-2 and 7-3 were replaced with 6-2 and 6-3 from the Lost Levels, and 8-4 was replaced with 8-4 from the Lost Levels. Uh, what else? This game also this game also entails the um, letter worlds um, from uh, from Lost Levels as well that have been edited a little bit. I don't know if it has like a World Nine. I'm pretty sure it doesn't, but I know it has the as the World A, World B, World C, World D. Hmm. Uh, and with that, uh, what do you say? What do you say? We get started. Now, I'm just going to play as Luigi the entire way through. Here we go. Now, you might notice the Goombas look kind of weird. Um, that is because they are actually, um, they are actually, they are actually caricatures. It, the Goomba is actually a caricature of, of Sun Plaza Nakano Kun, who is a, who is a DJ at um, All Night Nippon? I don't really know much about All Night ne All Night Nippon. I don't even know if it's even still around. Uh, the mushroom was moved over here, and as you can tell, it actually uses uh, most of the graphics from uh, Super Mario Brothers: The Lost Levels. <coughs> oh my goodness! Excuse me. Yeah. 
So yeah, the level, the game is um, virtually the same as um, as uh, the previous games. Um, I'm gonna try not to use cheats during this. I might use them in like the really light levels just just so I can get this and get this at you guys because this game is not nearly as hard as Lost Levels is. Trust me. But I still would recommend you take it slow and steady. And there we go. And that flag is, uh... Hold on. Okay, never mind. So I'm using Luigi so we can get, um, well the Koopas remain the same. I'm using Luigi mostly so we can, uh, get up the places we normally wouldn't be able to reach, um, too easily as Mario. Also the, uh, Starman that was once in this block is actually not here. I'm sure it's been moved somewhere, I'm just kind of not, I just don't really have, have the patience to go find it right now. So uh, I'm just going to grab myself some coins. I believe all the warp zones are still intact as well. That power up is still there. And also the one up that was once in that this block right here is also just the fire just the power up, so I guess if you're small you can try to get that. And these are the piranha plants. They are also characters of a DJ at um and all like all night Nippon named uh Where is where is his name? Yes, uh, Tamori. Yeah, that's just his name, Tamori, according to Mario Wiki. Alright, now that Troopa does not appear down there sometimes for some reason. Hey, buddy, you look funny. You're a funny buddy. I gotta wonder if that's something that's been used before. Funny buddy. Sounds like a Dr. Seuss character. Some of the levels uh, also had um, a, had a few changes to them. Uh, I don't really... I don't, uh, I'm probably not going to go over every single one of them, just because we'd be here all day if I did. Not like we're, not like we're here all day anyway, considering whenever I play an RPG, some of the videos go up to like 40 minutes long, but then again, I am kind of known for, uh, making really long videos at this day and age, but sometimes I feel like some, I think, I think I can drag egg on a bit too long, I mean, there was that one episode of Super Metroid that I felt like, felt went on especially long, so... Yeah, I want to try not to do that do that as much anymore. Oh, geez, careful. Oh no, that ain't good. Oh man, I wanted to see, um, I wanted to see, uh, Sun Plaza, and it's, or Con or whatever, uh, pop out of Bowser, but, oh well. Or King Koopa, rather. Um, when do we want to jump? Oh, jeez, um, uh, let's jump now. There we go. And that's the same logo as on the flag. Apparently we burn the bridge now. Thank you, Luigi, but our princess is in the castle. Yeah, that's not, 
that's not Toad, that is actually, um, a character of, a uh, Miyu Miyuki Nak Nakajima. Um, and so yeah, every Toad in the, in the game has been replaced with a character of, a has been replaced with a celebrity of, um, at All Night Ni Nippon, except for the last one. And I'll be sure to go over the, those when the time comes. And you can see the bush has been, have been replaced with microphones, showing that this is like a, a game based off a radio program. Dang it. Freaking Goomba messed me up. What? You stu- I thought you weren't gonna come out, you jerk. Don't have red piranha plant properties. There's anything in these. No, about to get hit by the Koopa. Just so, f just so funny seeing these enemies look like this. I want to see a boundary break episode out of this. Ooh, uh, let me go ahead and grab that. All right. Hey, Beanstalk! Let's go ahead and take it. Oh, it disappeared. Alright. Mmm. -hmm. Slow and steady wins the race. some way you can get up there. Hidden blocks? No? I guess you had to jump off the- I guess you had to bounce off the Koopa. Oh well. Alright. We're actually running low on time, so we should probably start moving. Whoa! Oh, okay. There you go. There you go. This part of the game is like completely unchanged. Hard to believe that this is actually an officially released Nintendo game, 1986. Kind of curious now. I want to like look up and look up a uh, possible uh, radio shows of um, All Night Nippon. Pretty sure it's pronounced Nippon. I guess Japanese uh, symbols probably would trains like that. Jeez. For forget it. Don't bother attacking the bloopers. Cheap, cheap, don't you dare. Okay. All right. Whew. I think the one up thing still applies with the flagpole and the coins and the time.
Alright, this one I'm worried about because of these guys. Worried some of them are gonna jump right into me like that. Dang it! Okay. Whoa. Okay. Oh jeez, Potaboos. Oh, okay, now it's just a regular fire bar. I don't know if there was a fire bar at all in the original game. Actually, wait, I think there was. Never mind. coins if we can. Crap, I don't think we can. No, we can't. Maybe the next one to fire. Alright, oh, coin block there. Not that I care. Uh, come on. Wait. There we go. What the heck? Alright, that is, um... Norotaki Kinasha. Okay guys, um, I'm gonna do the same thing I did in, uh, the original and the lost levels, um, and I believe, I, and we're going, I'm going to do two worlds per episode. Okay guys, next time, next time in All Night Nippon Super Mario Brothers, we're gonna take on worlds three and four. See you guys then.